We're going to look at using the Svantec Supervisor software. After you've installed the software, look for the shortcut link on your desktop like this. Double click and the Supervisor software will open. In this case, the software starts showing the Instrument tab with instruments down the side and the main part of the screen here. The main parts of the software include the instrument tab with the inventory, settings and download subtabs, and the data browser tab with the hand arm, whole body, sound level meter, noise dosimetry, wave and other subtabs. There is also a main menu button up at the top here with a variety of choices available. Included in the software is a folder here called Sample Files where there are some pre-recorded and saved files illustrating hand arm measurements, noise dosimetry measurements, whole body measurements and sound level meter measurements that have been installed when the software was loaded onto the computer. Each of these can be used to view and utilize the software in a variety of ways. Other elements of the main Svantec database library include the catalog. This is where all of the runs that you download will be stored. The recent folder, which will show the last downloaded files until the software is closed and then reopened. And then finally, the assigned folder where runs are shown once you have linked people and places and tasks to the different runs. The main part of this screen shows the table of results. Each of the rows represents a different type of measurement from uh, each of the similar instruments. In this case, we're in the noise dosimetry tab, so all of these recordings were taken with various Svantec noise dosimeters. Once you select a run from this list, in addition to seeing the text values in the table, you'll also see a time history chart and some key information underneath the green bar in the bottom edge of this display. These are the noise dosimetry runs, but all of the other instruments that work with Svantec Supervisor all basically work the same way. The hand arm measurements are shown if you select this tab, the whole body measurements are selected if you uh, see this tab, sound level meter measurements would show here and any separate wave files would show here. The other folder at the end here is for files such as maps from some of the instruments that store GPS position information.